Greetings, everyone. Dr. Brian Scott with you. We're studying insights to the end times. We're looking at things that are happening in our world today from a biblical perspective because we're coming to the end of time before the Lord Jesus Christ comes back to rule and reign on this earth. I hope you understand that. If not, keep tuned in and we'll help you understand some of these terms. Today we're looking at Matthew chapter 25 and the parable of the ten virgins. Five of them were wise and five were foolish. Five who were wise had uh, oil in their lamps. They were ready to go when the bridegroom came, as the parable says. The other five weren't ready, and uh, they didn't make it. Today I want to look at some of these terms with you because in uh, biblical terms we call this a type and shadow. It's a type of what's coming. It's a shadow of things that we'll see in the future. The term virgins represents believers, born-again believers, Christians in other words, unspoiled from the world. The uh, wise virgins represent those who are on fire for Jesus. In other words, they're 24-7 type Christians. They're really committed people. They're on fire. They live Christianity all the time. The foolish virgins are the type of believer who is nonchalant, careless, carefree, easygoing, maybe, maybe not. They, uh, they don't have the same level of commitment. The lamp represents their witness or their walk. Uh, their, their way they're seen in the world. The oil represents the Holy Spirit, the Holy Spirit anointing their life and guiding their life and leading their life. The bridegroom, of course, is the Lord Jesus Christ. And we know that he's coming. He's coming back to rule and reign. But prior to that, he's going to appear in the clouds uh, above the earth and he's going to shout, come up hither and the church or the believers who are rapture ready will be removed from this earth in a very short period of time. The bridegroom in this story is coming along. Uh, he arrives at midnight, it's dark, so the lamps are needed. The call goes out for the virgins to head out to uh, light the path. Five of them have oil in their lamps and they're ready to go. Five did not have oil in their lamps. In other words, when Jesus comes for the church of believers to receive them from the earth and take them up to heaven before the tribulation period, 50% of believers will be ready. 50% won't be ready. 50% who aren't ready know exactly what they should be doing, but they're doing it too late. And when they do a knock on the door saying, Lord, let us in, the Lord's going to say, I don't know you. I don't know you. We have to evaluate these scriptures by God's standards, not by our standards. We might come along and say, hey, we're in good shape. We're in super... Super shit. We're great Christians. Blue ribbon sheep Christians. Let's let the Lord decide that. Let's do everything we can to be the best Christian we can be and live for the Lord 24-7. I call you blessed today. I have more to share with you on the 50% rule tomorrow. I hope you'll join us then. Until then, I'm signing off. See you tomorrow.